All right, this is all air rifle stuff. Tell me about air rifles. Hey, Eric, my name is Joe with Predator JSB, uh, Predator International in Colorado. And we sell air gun ammunition from pellets to air gun slugs. So a lot of people aren't familiar with the whole air gun thing. So a lot of people remember the old 177s or even oh. BB guns. Yes, sir. Well, it's progressed from simple dome pellets to exotic hollow points that expanded or tipped, uh, ballistic tips on them. Uh, it's even gotten to where we have little biohazards on them to cause more damage on game. Wow. And we've even gotten into the slug market, which has been around for a while actually, but it's really caught on mainstream with air gunners the last two or three years. So with air gunners now, we're actually competing with 22 LR guys where we actually have rifles that are putting out 10, 40 feet per second for you know 100 foot pounds with a 40 grain 22 slug. That's crazy. It is crazy. And I do uh, test a lot of that to guys like you. Uh, my friend Cedric over there, who, who's a really mainstream guy, and started a lot of the stuff for people. Um, a lot of air gunners like myself and Cedric are long range guys with air guns. I know it's, you know, people laugh at it, especially uh, powder burner guys. They look, I don't know, but you know, we show what we're doing and how far we're shooting. I mean, we're, we're reaching out from being zeroed at 100 yards, going out to 400, 500 yards shooting prairie dogs or shooting targets. With air rifles? Yes. Wow. And yeah, we're not, we're not MOA you know, a lot of times, <laughs> but you know, if it's, if it's a 12 inch plate at 200 yards, well, I can tag it pretty good. I can tag it pretty good. Um, but yeah, the, just the evolution of air guns itself from going from BB guns to um, plinking to Olympic competition to hunting. I mean, right now you can get an air rifle from 17 cal all the way up to 82 cal. Wow. There are different platforms out there. Uh, Pre-charge pneumatics, PCPs are really popular now. So that's what we shoot major, uh, uh, majority rifles. I collect, so I have everything from pumpers and brake barrels to PCP. But um, yeah, if you're, if you're a powder burner who wants to get a lot of trigger time without spending a lot of money, I mean, here's a tin of 500 pellets, that'll cost you like $22. Uh, how many? How much will, <laughs> will 500, 338 yeah, rounds no, no. cost you? If, even if you can find them, they're gonna be expensive. Exactly, so we really enjoy what we do. And again, guys like you, and I follow you especially, it's good to see what you guys are doing, and it tra it does translate over to us. It's more of a trickle down effect, but you know you, you'll see rifles with, with wit muzzle brakes on there or custom muzzle brakes. Um, we're not re um, federally regulated, so we can have suppression on our rifles. That's really nice too, so we can keep it quiet. It helps strip a lot of turbulent air away. Still, not as good as a, a, a muzzle brake. Um, your, your your tuner. I see a lot of arrogant guys starting to get your tuners now. Awesome. So yeah, it's it's really coming full circle, and when we had the whole coronavirus, whatever, if it existed, <laughs> um, we had a lot of firearm guys come over to our side because they got trigger time, and then rifles such as the Air Force um, Texan, which is in Texas also, Air Force air guns, um, guys were shooting those, and you know they're shooting 45 cal, and they were spending, you know, twenty dollars for some ammunition compared to what 45 um, you know, bullets would cost. And they were able to get the trigger time they wanted. They were able to keep their, their training intact. In they were able to go out there and, and practice like they want to practice, you know? And yeah, they get loud, so you know, you're not gonna do this in your backyard. You, what we do, and a lot, especially shooting slugs or big bore ammunition for air guns, we don't do it in our backyard. We actually go out to shooting ranges we go out to our own ranges. We have them. We're and we, we're stretched out. We're you know we're incrementing and in ten yards out. You know I know guys who have thousand yard ranges, and we we know guys who've actually shot a thousand yards with their air guns, modified two fifty seven air rifles. Wow, that's pretty cool, man. Well, good. I appreciate that. Well, I appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you and, very much. Uh, good job. Thank you.